my loves welcome back to my channel so today um... this video is about something that i knew was gonna happen i knew that eventually i was gonna wipe out on my little moped bike and sure enough that's what ended up happening and you know what like the saying goes shit happens sometimes I just wasn't expecting this to happen at such a slow speed, like less than walking speed, maybe what, two, three miles an hour. But anyhow, if you're a little squeamish and don't like the sight of blood or wounds, this is not the video for you. Or if you're eating, well, you might want to stop eating now. First, <laughs> first, uh... Uh, first stop is right beside maybe two blocks away from her place. <laughs> I wanted to grab some oranges. Uh. We were out touring around having a little fun on our bikes when, like I said, shit happens. Welcome. Oh, wow. Hey, check out the old Studebaker. Yeah, it's a four-door, but you know what? The cool factor is, uh, yeah, definitely 10 out of 10. Okay, how's this? Ready? Look at that, <laughs> the mad biker wiped out. Uh, I think my partner in crime uh, stopped and I think I tried to go around her and I came off the bike and bit the cement. <laughs> if it was dirt, it would have been a little bit better, but yeah, jaw is swollen up. I don't know if it's broken or not, but uh, maybe fractured, fractured my head. Uh, so maybe a full face helmet is a better idea. So, anyways, good times. <laughs> what Chuck say? Good times. <laughs> man, Chuck is a plum fool, man. Yeah, it hurts. Tomorrow is gonna be uh, worse. So I limped the bike home and didn't damage too much. A little bit of paint scuffing. That's what we did. And I bent the handlebars. So the wheels are straight right now, but the handlebars are, look at, see? So the handlebars are crooked, so my body took took that and bent it, and I'm having so I'm gonna try and straighten it out a little bit there. And oh yeah, my jacket. I scratched the shit out of my jacket. Look at a few holes in the jacket. So oh yeah, good times. And look at my riding gloves. Holy shit! I ripped ripped the shit out of my driving gloves when I landed on the pavement. And I guess <laughs> yeah. I kind of woke up like a little bit groggy, so I almost got knocked out. And you know, I was spitting out cement and I broke off a chunk of my tooth. I spit out a piece of my tooth or a couple little shards. So yeah, ugly scene, boys. Oh, is that? No, nothing. Just that. Two hours later. Okay, check this out. Wow, a lot of fluid coming out. I guess that's a good thing I'm not all dried up, right? Yeah, it feels, uh, I can feel it, slightly. <laughs> uh, well, how about five hours into it? How does that look? Uglier or better? It's not uh, going up as much. It's starting to swell up and it, oh, heal up too. So, <laughs> wow, it, it's, it's weird. It looks like I was doing like 100 miles an hour and smack my face. But you know what? I was going maybe three miles an hour and just kind of endoed so <laughs> and face planted so it looks a lot worse but yeah mouth is swollen up so it's hard to eat food and obviously side faces yeah i gotta look over here anyhow i slept a bit so i'm gonna try and sleep this off and see how tomorrow bring brings okay cheers stay safe my friends